So binoculars, they do go out of collimation after some time, maybe if you've had a knock, and they need realigning because you see a double image. And so just to recap from my previous video, you can peel that back there and there'll be a little screw and you can turn that one way or the other and try to do this while you're looking through them and then you can see the images on both sides coming closer together and until you get a single image or much closer than it was before and why am I always pointing to the right hand side? Basically I'm right handed and it's easier for me to pick them up, look through them and turn that screw one way or the other but by all means, if you want to do the other side, do so. And you may have to do both sides just to get that final adjustment. But there are occasions when, no matter, and it, it was actually with this particular set of binoculars, I couldn't quite get them lined up using just that screw there and the one on the other side. But what you do have, and again, this is applicable to binoculars where you can easily pull this rubber cover back. Some you can't, some are a hard surface and then you might have to have them sent off. But so yeah, I'm not having to dismantle it. I know, I know it's difficult to see in this video but there is actually another little, you can just see it, another little screw there on the end of the screwdriver and you can do exactly the same thing there. And what I find is, with these, obviously it's a bit more difficult to look through them while you're doing this. And so it's a case of just moving it and then having a look through to see if it, you can then go back to the original screws and fine tune it. And I found with these, I put the screwdriver in and I turned it about a quarter to the right. And then I went back to these and I was able then, just literally within a few seconds, Peel that back and uh, go back to how, how I originally collimated them and uh, I found it was bang on. And so whenever you're collimating these pure prism binoculars always start off with the left or right hand side here and see if you can get it very close to collimation and if you need just that little bit extra fine tuning Go to this little screw here, and there is one on the other side. Again, for, for no obvious, for no particular reason, I, I just peeled that back to re reel that screw. And move it one way or the other. Go back to these, and by trial and error, you should be able to get them re realigned. So, and just to repeat, in my last video I referred to a sp specific brand. This really applies to all Pura Prism binoculars where you can easily access the two screws or the four screws I should say on the body so as always I hope that helps thank you very much for watching and please check out the links in the description below